Come on, it's Halloween night. Let's go trick-or-treating. We have to wait for Colin. He can't be too much longer. How long does it take to put on a Halloween costume? I hope nobody's dressed up as anything too scary tonight. Does anyone even know what costume Colin picked? Nope. Not a clue. Well, whatever it is, it better be worth missing out on all this candy. He probably just grabbed something from one of those boxes. Slicked back hair, a nice dark cape, and the finishing touch, a pointy pair of vampire fangs. Uh, uh, uh. I want to suck your blood. Whoa! Thanks a lot, Cape. Uh oh. Huh? I'm stuck. Uh, guys? Neek? Lunik? And Atari? Anybody? Did you hear something? Nope. Tonight's the night, Guitaris. My favorite holiday, Halloween. Um, what's with the headband? I'm all bad. Aren't we going trick or treating? No, no, we have much bigger plans. But I want to go trick or treating. Oh, I'll buy you some candy later. Right now, we need to focus on scaring Kalip and his siblings out of La La Land. But we do that every other day. Why can't we take a break? Because this holiday gave me a brilliant idea. And you're about to meet him. Him? Hoshi, start pressing those buttons. Now, Guitaris, I need you to start the lightning machine. Fine, whatever. It's working! It's alive! It's alive! <laughs> What exactly is alive? I call him Franken Collip. Somebody go check on him? Colb can handle himself. He's probably just being a perfectionist. Help! Oh, it's no use. I'm gonna be stuck here forever. Now that's crazy talk. They have to come up eventually. They wouldn't just leave without me. Let's just leave without him. Hello, Nick. What? Otherwise, all the candy is gonna be gone. We are not leaving without Colin. Mm. Okay, Franken Caleb, now's your chance. Huh? It's me, Dr. Malice. Huh? Your creator? What? I'm speaking to you inside your head. Uh. No, 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 stop, stop! I put a radio in your head so I can communicate with you, got it? Now, see them over there? Mm-hmm. I need you to go up and scare them. Mm. Let's give it two more minutes and then we'll go check on him. <sighs> We thought you'd never come down, call it. Cool costume. Now, let's get that candy. 
You know, just cause you're dressed like a monster doesn't mean you have to act like one too. <laughs> okay, you do you. What? They're not even scared? I think they confused Frank and Colip for the real Colip. That's not supposed to happen. Do you have a backup plan? I don't need a backup plan. This isn't over yet. Frank and Colip, come in, Frank and Colip. They think you're somebody else. So I need you to be really, really scary. <laughs> Yeah, that's really scary, Collip. You sure got me. Huh? We're doomed. <laughs> Almost there and... Oh! Yes! Freedom! Ha <laughs> ha! I mean, excellent, Mr. Boxes. Excellent. <laughs> oh, you gotta be kidding me. If Frank and Caleb can't be scary, I'll just have to settle for the next best thing. Attention, Frank and Caleb. Mm. Do you see that haunted house over there? Go to it! Why? Just do it! Mm -hmm. Um, where's Collip going? It looks like he's heading for that spooky house over there. <laughs> oh, I'm not going in there. Me neither. I don't care how much candy they might give out. Well, I guess that leaves just me. Wait up, Collip! Finally, things are about to get pretty scary. What's inside that place? I don't know. I can't seem to see indoors with this thing. Well, this Halloween really sucks. Your blood. <laughs> oh, maybe if I try rocking it back and forth. Huh. Huh. Uh. Finally! I better get out of here before something else tries to stop me. Don't even think about it. I guess they really did leave without me. Some siblings they are. You think they're okay in there? Yeah, I mean, it's not like they're in a haunted house or something. Oh, wait. Hey guys, thanks for waiting up for me. I, I, you, you there, I... Spit it I, out. I, 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 we I, thought you were in that haunted house with Neek. What? No, I've been stuck in the tree house. That means Neek is in there with... A real monster. Monster? Oh, Dr. Malice must be behind this. We gotta go save her. Oh no. This is gonna be really, really scary. Well, I guess I called that one wrong. Why did we have to go trick-or-treating? 
Agora. Nick, you made all that scary stuff happen? Everyone needs a good scare on Halloween. But Nick, that's a real monster next to you. I know. You do? Yeah, I figured it out when we got inside here. But he's actually really nice. Hi. And with a few modifications, I think he might be able to help us play a trick back on Dr. Malice. I can't believe my creature was a failure. And on Halloween, too. Well, tough luck. Live and learn. Now, let's go trick-or-treating. Yes, I suppose I can always bury my sorrows in sugar. The doorbell? Who could that be? We never get trick-or-treaters out here. Ah! It's a Franken Malice! <laughs> I think I might like you better than the real one. Ah, happy Halloween! Happy Halloween!